This simulation is used to look at the relationships that exist when we convert elastic energy into kinetic energy. Students begin this program with a hockey player in the crease up against the spring, which is attached to the boards. They hit the set Trevor function, and then they can pull the hockey player back to different distances. And then once they got him in the position they want, they can fire him down the ice. His elastic energy will turn into kinetic energy. I suggest timing him from blue line to blue line in order to get his speed. So once we have his speed, we can uh, then look at how the speed is affected by the different parameters. We can change things like the spring constant of the spring, the mass of the hockey player, or how far we pull the hockey player back. Obviously, students will be changing one parameter at a time. They'll run a few different trials with a few different values, and then they will graph to see how the changing parameter affects the speed of the hockey player moving down the ice. We then use this to talk about the transformation of elastic energy into kinetic energy.